Hey y'all, what's going on? Happy Saturday. This is Tanner from TanManBaseballFan.com. Uh, I came back home after doing a lot of stuff today and picked up some uh, uh, packages from the mail. I'm really kind of bummed actually because the one package that I really was looking forward to, um, I did not get. So uh, they said that they're going to re-deliver um, on Monday, hopefully. So I will have a hard time sleeping until that comes because uh, that's actually a pretty great deal that I, uh, that I did with another uh, super collector. His name is Aaron. Hi, Aaron. Um, and I will also be writing an article about it as well. So I was uh, did a bunch of stuff on garage selling this morning with my wife. That's one of our favorite things to do together. Um, also went to the library with our son and he picked up about 10 different Star Wars books. So uh, what else? What else did we do? Oh yeah, that's right. We went to the store and yeah, it was a it was a packed day. And now I'm finally able to sit down and take a look at these cards that I got. So love getting cards in the mail. First one. There we go. 2016 Tops Archives snapshots black and white version autograph of Jose Canseco. This is hand numbered to ten on the back. Again, I said this yesterday um, because I picked up the uh, the regular autograph, which is numbered to 105, and the negative that's numbered to five. Uh, people have really been enjoying these boxes. Now, a lot of the boxes that people have been picking up, which is strange, like some people might pick up three, four, or five boxes, and some of the boxes will have all of the exact same cards except for the autograph, which I thought was kind of strange there. So. Anyways, let me uh, show y'all the three cards together. So here they are. Number to 105, number to 10, and number to 5. So there's there are those. So that's a an outstanding way to start. I really I really do like those. Yeah, I probably like them a lot more even just because I've uh, heard so much good things about him. So I guess psychologically that probably did something for me there. Okay, so up next is it's a Jock Peterson. These are just throw-ins by the way. So uh, Kevin Padlow, Max Scherzer, and Brendan Rogers. Like I said, these are all throw-ins and, and these are kind of cool cards uh i guess what are they bowman platinum yeah they're bowman platinum i've actually never seen them before but those are just the fillers uh to show this one interestingly enough aside from the one of one i think that's the only one else the only other one i need um this was the hardest one for me to get not really hard it's numbered to 125 but i picked up the unnumbered the 99 the 75 the 50 and the 25 first um so and to show you kind of what this looks like if you haven't seen it before. It's really neat. They're really neat cards. The only way that I probably would have much rather have had them is if this was this area here actually had a piece of jersey or patch, which by the way, I'm, I'm waiting on my 2014 Strata Redemption Canseco. I've been waiting on about three years, I believe now, or two and a half years, I guess. And can't wait to get that. Hopefully they'll make it. I don't know why they haven't yet because Jose has been signing like crazy uh, for the past two and a half years for them and uh, still nothing over here. But I hope the the wait will be worth it. Hope they have a fantastic patch card um, to go with it and uh, uh, behind that and that'd be awesome. Anyways, uh, this is a 1993 uh, Topps. It's 2016 Archive Signature Series um, and uh, it is numbered to 25. Here's the one I got in yesterday. It's the gold and it's number to three. And I actually have the 2015 Topps Archive Signature Series. Um, and uh, I had pretty much vowed to not uh, get any duplicates of the 2016s that I already have a 2015 version of. But because I do like the, 2000, or the 1993 Topps card, it was his first Rangers card, I figured I'd go ahead and uh, get that one. I did the same thing with A7 Tops. I'll probably be picking up the A6 Tops, even though there's a 2015 version of that. And uh, yeah, and, and probably a few others too. I'm not, I'm not sure. We'll see the price on them. This is the last one 
for the day and for the week. And this is a printing plate. It's 2016 Topps Bunt. It's the magenta printing plate. There it is. See the back, one of one. So as a recap, I received today Archive Signature Series 93 Tops, 2016 Strata, number to 125. The Archive Snapshot, numbered to 10, hand numbered, black and white. And then the Bunt Printing Plate, one of one. Out of all these, I would have to say, uh, I almost want to say this is my favorite of the day, uh, just because I do love the 93 Tops, but I think that's going to take a back seat to this guy here. I think this is my favorite one uh, for tonight. Yeah it's, yeah, it's probably, it's actually evening now. So, uh, All right, well, thank you all for watching. I hope you all have a fantastically wonderful Saturday evening and, and Sunday, and uh, please check back on Monday because I'll probably do my next video there. Uh, eh, I might do I might do a video on Sunday. I'm not sure just yet. We'll see. Uh, but anyways, I hope you all have a fantastic rest of the weekend. And um, at the very latest, I'll probably see you all on Monday. Take care. Bye.